What's up guys, Genius Pie Trap, and this is a follow-up to my Steam Booster Pack tutorial video. So if you have not watched the first Steam Booster Pack tutorial, I suggest watching that here. And I'm going to put a little box here, and you can click this box at any time in the video and watch the first Steam Booster Pack tutorial if none of this is making any sense to you. Definitely watch this video first. In this video, I'm going to ask a bunch of questions that came up in the comments about the first video. Mainly, people asking why they haven't gotten a booster pack yet, even though they have all the eligible drops, and some other question. I also like want to bring up this specific question from Flying Ninja Boar. So if you are level 50, do you get a booster pack every time someone crafts a badge? Because you have a 100% chance. Example, if a group of 6 people crafted a badge, will you get 6 booster packs? Excellent question, and I'm very glad he asked it because I could see how people think that. Sadly, it's not the case. You don't get a 100% chance to get them. But I thought I'd go over this and break down the math for you guys. Now, if you remember for the last video, again, click the box. For every 10 levels equals a 20% increase on the Steam Booster Pack your chances for the Steam Booster Pack. Doesn't, it sounds better than what it really is, and I'll break that down. So now if you're level 20, you get a 40% increase, and so on and so forth. I am level 102, I think. Well, level 100 will equal a 200% chance. Now does that mean, again, according to Flying Ninja Boars, statement he was wondering does that mean I get two booster packs every time somebody crafts a badge sadly no I wish that would be amazing but that's not the case so let's let's break down the math here all right say we're eligible for a booster pack we got all the drops now there's also 500 other people there's 500 people total that are eligible for this booster pack. Somebody crafts a badge and this booster pack is eligible. It's going to one of these 500 people. You are only one person. So let's divide that by one there. And we're dividing the one by the 500, I should say. Um, that equals 0, 0, 0.02, 0, 0, 0.002. And we'll times that by 100 to get a percentage. Equals 0.2%. So 0.2%, that's your, that is your chance on getting that booster pack if, if 500 people. Now obviously if there's less people that have that are eligible for that booster pack, it's going to be more. So say there's only two people that have that booster pack, you have a 50-50 chance of, or I'm sure if there's two people eligible for the booster pack, you're going to have a 50-50 chance. But as this number increases, your chances go lower and lower and lower. I would imagine that some games that have been out for a long time, like say, that have had the, the cards for a long time, like Terria or Team Fortress 2 or something like that, this number has is, is got to be a lot higher, you know, increase, decreasing your chance. Now, again, if you remember, remember, for every 10 levels, you get that 20% increase. Now, does that mean you get a 20.2% increase on getting the cards sadly no this you got to think of this as a rate this the percent increase is affecting your rate of booster cards okay so what we want to do is let's take that 20 percent increase so say we got level 10 so we get increased by 20 percent right and we want to divide that by 100 to get a decimal and that equals 0.2 this is what we want to add. We want to add this to our base, which our base is 1. So plus 1 equals 1.2. So now let's see how that affected us. Now if we're level 10 as compared to below level 10, we got again we got those 500 people. Now our new base which is 1.2 and that equals 0 0.0024 now and then we'll times that by 100 and that equals 0.24 percent I'm running out of room so 
as you can see here, we basically got a 0.04% increase on getting that badge from that level increase. Not very much. Now, I am, for example, level 102, I believe. So I get the 100%. So I get a 200% change or 200% increase to my base. So let's just quick figure that out. And I can, so that we can, can compare what a lower level gets according to, compared to a higher level. So um, let's take our, let's actually make some room here. Again, guys, sorry for my atrocious handwriting. It's kind of hard to, the way I got this camera set up, it's hard to uh, uh, get a good hand position. And I'm, I have terrible penmanship to begin with, so I mainly type stuff up. But I thought this would be kind of fun to do on a dry erase. But okay, anyway. So now, again, I have a two, since I'm level, over level 100, I have a 200% increase. So we'll make that into a fraction, 200. And that equals two, of course. And we'll add that to our base, which remember our base was one plus one equals three. So now my base is three. So now again, we'll use that same example where 500 people are eligible, a new badge gets crafted. Divided by three now. I'm sorry, three divided by 500. That equals 0.006, and we'll times that by 100, equals 0.6. All right, which the other one I believe was 0.24. So we have a 0.24% versus a 0.6%. 0.6% equals level 100 person, Again, that's for the example use. If there was 500, again, that's going to change. 0.24% was a level 10 person, I believe. So, you know, that's still very, not very good odds, I guess, either way, of you getting that booster pack. So if you're wondering why you haven't gotten a booster pack, you're eligible, it's been a month, and you still haven't gotten a booster pack, this is why. It's because your chances are slim. I... I am eligible for a ton of games and that I can get booster packs on and I generally get maybe one per week at level 100 okay and that's only because I have and to qualify for so many so if you're you know if you just have that one game and you're waiting for someone to craft a badge for that one game it's it's next to impossible you know to get to be drawn for that 0.24 percent it's the people that are eligible for a lot of games are, are a higher level that's the people that are getting the booster packs you know even here it doesn't seem it's the real kicker is owning a lot of games that you're eligible for those booster packs all right guys i hope that explains a lot of things if you guys got any questions if you think my math's wrong challenge my math i guess um, i'm not saying i am definitely no mathematician this is kind of what i've come up with in my head to kind of break it down for you guys um, but let me know Genius Pie Trap, over and out, later, bye. Victory. The outcome was never really in doubt. Eat my dust. Let's have a go at it. Godspeed, you magnificent bastard. Giddy up. It is good to be giant, man. Guts and glory.